Which of the three keys is the best in Pet Simulator 99? That's what I'm going to be finding out in this video by spending 1,000 crystal, tech, and void keys to figure out which gives you the best stuff for your money. So before I get to using the keys, I've gone ahead and completely emptied my inventory. As you see, I have all these boxes, keys, all of these things, which obviously I cannot put in my inventory since they're untradeable. But here they are, the 1,000 keys, 1,000 crystal keys, which is worth 21 million and 10 million and a half worth of tech keys and 7.66 million worth of crystal keys. I've also emptied my potions and enchants as you can get those from the chests. I did not empty my ultimates though, but this is the ultimates I have. I'm not sure if they give you ultimates. I've also not emptied my pet inventory if I go here as I do not own any of the hugest that come out of these chests. So hopefully we can get one this video and add another one to my collection here. But keep in mind though that obviously all these chests are luck based. So you know, I might get quite lucky or I might get terrible luck. And obviously I also have my keys mastery. Where is it here? 58, which does indeed give me some better loot from these certain chests and also the chance to keep the keys, which I will be keeping track of how many keys I keep in order to make sure I don't use more than a thousand keys. But also annoyingly, if you just saw there, I just get random items since I have max uh, merchant mastery from the RNG update. So that's gonna kind of screw with this a bit, but it shouldn't screw too much as these things are quite low valued items. So we'll probably take off like a couple thousand at the end in order to figure out how much items we got. All right, so here I am. I've made it here to the crystal chest, which will be the first chest, which we do, where we have the chance to get the huge wizard Westy and all of this other stuff. So I've got my thousand keys here. So we are going to start using them and hopefully we can get a huge or something like that. So let's see, first key. Okay, we got some enchants, some flags, alright. So I'm obviously not going to show me opening every single uh, key because that would take forever. Like maybe I'll post one where I do not do any cuts at all if you want to watch that. But I'm going to be cutting to when I get something good, so let's speed this up. Ooh, two exotic pets in one. Damn, that's our first charm. Alright, this here is the final key. So let's use it in the hope that I can get a huge. Let's see. Just a whole lot of junk. Alright, so that there was the final key. So let's check. Do I have the huge, first of all? Wizard. No, I do not have it at all. Okay, so we did not get a huge from this. So let's see what we got. So we got some coin jars. We got lots of giant coin jars. We got some magic coin jars. We got quite a few flags. Uh, we have some of this fruit. Obviously, we did not get this much fruit and definitely not shiny fruit. These bundles we did not get, but we did get seven charm stones though, which is pretty good. I still have 43 keys left since this is the amount of keys I recorded that I saved. Uh, through my mastery so here we got a bonus charm we got some coins charm and we also got this tnt charm which isn't too bad uh potions we got all these obviously you know some of these are from the vending machines and of course we also got these enchants here we got 19 exotic pets out of that 12 fortunes 17 minus touches 27 lightnings and all of these other enchants i'm not sure this one can come out of there uh, it doesn't seem like a can though, so I'm gonna go ahead put all this into a box and see how much that box is worth And then we can figure out how if I profited or did not All right I have gone ahead and boxed up everything now in this box called crystal key and as you see there we have seven hundred ninety two thousand dollars worth of things which I'm pretty sure is definitely a loss. Let's see each key is worth 7.69k each, and 43 of these is already worth 330k, so we definitely made a big loss on that one. We only made 792k dollars worth of things. 
So here is everything I believe that we got out of it. Uh, some of these enchants may be, you know, way more than I actually did since I have the uh, since I have the vending machine mastery. So you know that might screw with the enchants a little bit. But this is everything we got in one place. We got some of these enchants. We got these potions. And I also realized this thing doesn't get fruit, which I thought it did, but we got this TNT charm. See, all the more valuable things are here at the top. Uh, the charm stones is probably the most valuable thing we got out of everything. So yeah, all the rest of these things aren't worth that much. So out of all that, we made quite a big loss. So let's go ahead and calculate how big of a loss I just made. All right, here we have the calculator and I've gone back and looked at the footage. I had $7.66 million worth of crystal keys. So we are going to put that in right now. So 766000. That million yet? There we go. That's a million. Seven million dollars. And then we got to subtract and we made 800K. So I'll just round out to 800K. And there we go. Let's see. We made a loss of $6,860,000. That is a lot of money that we just lost. $6,860,000. Oh my god, that was a lot of money. So hopefully when I go to use the tech keys in a second, hopefully we will be able to actually profit with the tech keys. So let's move on to the tech keys now. All right, now that we finished doing the crystal key, now here we are in the tech world to do the tech chest right here. I've got my 1,000 tech keys right here. I've also emptied my inventory again. Uh, there is just a luck potion there and just that since I got that from my mastery. But that should not matter too much. So I really hope that we can actually profit with this one since we made quite a big loss on the crystal key but we should be able to do that a lot easier because there are some things in here that are worth a lot more than there were and have you guys ever noticed that there's like a sound that comes from this look if i zoom out here no sound well it's very quiet but then i zoom all the way in you hear this it's like making a sound and i don't even know why but yeah so the huge here is the huge cyber agony so hopefully we can get one and there are some more valuable things in here, such as ultimates, since those were introduced in this world. So hopefully we can make some money. And I've also got an auto clicker this time so that I can automate this. And let's see what I can get. Looks like we got a fortune right there. That's pretty good. Oh, looks like we actually got a mini chest there as well. That's crazy. Oh, look at that. TNT charm and a... What is that thing called again? I forgot what it was called. Oh, look at that. Mini chest. Wow. Alright, I've gone ahead and I've used all 1,000 tech keys. So let's go ahead and see what I got. Alright, so here we have the items. We got 120 TNT crates, 33 pinatas. We got 43 sprinklers, 32 lucky blocks. That's pretty good. We got like over 100 of each flag here. I don't think you get fruit from that. We got 25 charm stones, 41 of these mini chests, 873k worth of them. We got some gift bags, 368k. We got some 48 tech keys. Those were the ones that were saved through my mastery. We also have a booth voucher here. We also got this glittering charm, which is pretty good. 130K for this. Got TNT charm. We saw all these guys earlier. Let's move on to potions. I have no idea what came out from it, but I, uh, from last time I've learned it's the potions with the most. So we got quite a lot of diamonds potion. We got quite a lot of these guys, some of those. And we also got some tier fours. I don't think it went to tier five though. I'm not sure. Maybe it did. And then we've also got 31 exotic pets, 19 fortunes, 36 minus touch, 45 lightnings, and 45 happy pets. So from initial assessment, it doesn't look like we're going to lose too much money. 
but I'm not sure yet. So let me go ahead and bundle all these up into a box. Okay, there we go. I bundled everything up into a box. So it's now time to reveal how much everything I got is worth. So let's see. Here it is, this box. It is worth 6.63 million. All right, we got 46 items. We got all of these. If you want to see it all laid out here, this is what we got from a thousand keys. So I don't actually think that's a profit, but let's go ahead and calculate that right now. All right, so let's go ahead and calculate it now. So we had $10.8 million worth of tech keys. All right, there we go. $10.8 million worth of tech keys right there. And then let's see, we subtract the amount that we ended up with, which is 6.63 million. So let's do that, 6.63 million. So let's see, another zero, nope, one more. All right, there we go. And now equal, we have lost four and a half million dollars from that. So, yeah, that's still not very good. We still haven't made any profit yet. None of these, uh, what's it? None of these keys have been profitable yet. So hopefully, when we go to avoid key, it will be a lot more profitable than these ones. But I highly doubt it, considering these void keys are very expensive. So let's now move on to the void keys. All right, here I am at Void World, the final stop for today. And over there is the void chest, which we are going to spend the 1,000 void keys on. I've gone ahead and emptied my inventory again. There is nothing here, but the 1,000 void keys here were 20.8 million. So we've got no enchants and no potions. So looks like this chest actually does also give some slightly better loot as obviously the further the chest is through the game, obviously the better loot it should be given. So as you see, we can look at some of the loot here. We got a whole lot of these charms. So hopefully we can get one of these charms. All right, so let's go ahead and start opening this. So first key, we got tap power six, I think, or that's, yeah, six. And we got nothing. All right, let's get to one of you stolen my keys. Oh my god, guys! Look at it! I think I got it! Oh, it's growing! Oh my god. We got it! The huge holographic cat. Wow, okay. That is the first huge we've gotten. Look at it. There's 64.8k of them. It's worth almost 40 million. Look at it. It's like glitching. I did not expect to get this, wow. Let's see, how many keys do we still have left? We still got 100 keys to go, and so far we've saved 45 keys. So let's quickly finish that off, and let's see what else we've got. <laughs> All right, guys, we have finally made it to the very last key of this video. Look at this, 51 keys. I've managed to save 50 void keys this time around. So we've got one more key to use, so let's go ahead and do it. And it would be crazy if we got another one of these guys, but obviously that's not going to happen. And there we go. That is it. So let's go ahead and have a look at what we've gotten. So first of all, starting here, we got this guy, which you guys saw just like a minute ago. This huge holographic cat right here. So let's go ahead and look at my inventory. We got 43 lucky blocks, we got a bunch of sprinklers. Almost a million dollars worth of pinatas. We've got 200k worth of TNT crates. We got a bunch of flags. We have a million dollars worth of mini chests, 44. We got 15 charm stones. We've got 165 gift bags worth half a million. We've also got ourselves 18 booth slot vouchers, 300k. Of course, we got the royalty charm from earlier and all of this other charm stuff. Potions, we got lots of tier 4s here. We got some tier 5s, as you see there. And enchants, we got 19 exotic pets, 14 fortunes, 28 minus touches, 49 lightnings, and 46 happy pets. 
So overall, this void chest was definitely a W because look at that. I got this huge right here. So let's go ahead, put this all inside a box and see how much it's worth. All right, guys, I have gone ahead and boxed it up. Let's have a look at what, how much the box is worth. Ta-da, $49.6 million. That is the most so far. Look at this. We got our huge holographic cat here along with this row having all of our most expensive stuff. So this huge holographic cat is the best thing we've got today so far we also got royalty shiny and all of these enchants and potions and other stuff so all of those are worth quite a bit and this is definitely our most valuable box let's now move on to the calculations all right so here is the calculator so we had almost 50 million so let's do 50 million to start off I wish they would put commas in this thing so that'd be easier. Okay, but that's 50 million right there. And we had 20.8 million worth of void keys. So this should be quite clear cut here. So there we go. 20 million. I need to get this right. Is that right? Nope. There we go. That is now right. So now if we hit equal. We profited $29,200,000 from that. So that's pretty good. We made double and some extra of our money using the void keys. So maybe the void keys might actually be worth it. I originally started with 3,000 keys, 1,000 for each of the chests in the game. And now I've spent them all and let's go over what I found. So I've managed to make 57 million diamonds worth of stuff from all these chests. And I've spent the grand total of 40 million on keys. So I've actually managed to make quite a big profit. But which of these chests gave me the best returns? It was obviously the void chest by a long shot. And doing some research has led me to find the huge chances for these chests. So here they are on the screen. And as you see, the void chest has the best chance at getting you a huge. So I'm not completely certain if these are actually, you know, still the chances, if they changed or not. But from my experiment, they've seemed to be correct as I got a huge out of the void chest and none of the other chests. So after doing these tests, it is safe to say that the void chest is the one with the best luck and most likely to make your diamonds back. But I'm not saying go spend all your diamonds on void keys, but there is a higher chance of you profiting than the others. And remember, it's all just luck. Anyways, if you want to know how I made a clan without many diamonds, click on the video to my left. Otherwise, please subscribe and YouTube thinks you'll like this video on my right.